Uh, we're the judges. We'd like to welcome you to a presentation on Best Buy this evening. <laughs> First of all, let me say that uh, on behalf of the judges, you folks did a, a tremendous job. And uh, we really appreciate all the work that was put into this case of analysis. We do have some comments which we'd like to share with you. Um, first of all, uh, on, the, uh, on the good side, there were some really innovative ideas and some innovative concepts out there. And as you look forward to Best Buy, uh, I think you may see some of those. When you're, when you're doing a presentation before your board, um, your presentations are, you have 15 minutes to, to speak about the presentations. And uh, there was a lot of information on some of the slides. I think it's important that when you do your, your actual uh, handouts, that you leave enough white space so that your board members can really read that and begin to, so they can understand it and ask your questions. Because you've got a lot to go through, and we know that. So just something for the future as you're doing presentations, keep that, keep, keep more white space and uh, less, uh, more slides if you have to get more information out. From the standpoint of, uh, of uh, team number two, uh, we thought that uh, your concept of mining the company data was, uh, was good. It's something that not a lot of companies do and it's something from a marketing standpoint that absolutely needs to be done if you're going to understand your customer. The, um, uh, like I said, your, your slides were a little difficult to, uh, to read and, uh, and, you went and you had a 15 minutes to go through that presentation. The, you're talking to your board. Your board knows your history. Uh, you spent a, a good a fair amount of time going through the history. Perhaps you would uh, you might cut that down a little bit in the future. Uh, very, very articulate. You did a great job of articulating the issues and articulating your presentation. Um, team number one, your uh, your uh, uh, analysis was uh, very innovative. Uh, I think you did a good job of vetting your uh, your your project called Kickstarter. Um, one of the things that's very interesting is that your risk is high, but your rewards could be very great with that, uh, with that product. Again, very, uh, a good job at articulating the issues and a good job at uh, explaining the, uh, the financials. Tip number three, uh, another innovative concept. You know, it's kind of like uh, you keep your friends close, but you keep your enemies closer. And uh, that's what uh, we believe you're, you're talking about when you're looking at partnering with some of these competitors that you have and bringing that to the floor. Um, we, we do have a question as to if the object of Amazon is to eat our lunch, why would they want to partner with us? But that's something that, that has to be vetted out. Um, we, uh, when, when we talked about the, the questions, there were some comments about we anticipated that question. Uh, let me remind you, our consultants, and you should anticipate every question. <laughs> and uh, uh, so, uh, another thing. Um, and uh, this is great when you can't read your own writing. Um, oh, and, and you're, when we were talking about the competition, um, I think it's an interesting concept that uh, you use. You really take the competencies that Best Buy has now and expand on those through actually helping people use this. You're way too old to understand this, but in, uh, I told this story in the past. If you ever watched The Miracle on 34th Street, um, Santa was uh, working for Macy's and they had a competition with Bloomingdale's and uh, somebody came in to buy, and this is a true story by the way, even though it was in movie. Somebody came in to buy something at uh, Macy's and Santa said, don't buy it here go by it at Bloomingdale's because it's less expensive. And that began a partnership between Bloomingdale's and Macy's even though they were fierce competitors. And that, uh, I was reminded of that when we talked to you. When, we, when you talked to us. Um, okay, enough of this. Um, our choice. Do you, does anybody want to add anything else? Yeah, we're just the quality of And so we can see why you're right at the top. Thank you. Our choice for the uh, 22nd Richard Reeves Ellington competition is uh, 
team number one. teams to come up on the stage to for photographs with the judges and the faculty. The rest of the students, you may you may leave now. Have a good night. The rest of the students.